We're in the final minutes of a deadlocked game here at Striker Land. Where Sultan's new sand and defense has kept Super Strikers from even a single shot on goal. <laughs> Twisting Tiger, how about we try this? El Matador and I draw the defense back, opening the channel through the sand trap. That's when you send a power cross. Tiger sets it up. But the chance is wasted by the forwards. Throw in to Sultans and Duval takes it quickly. The big defender finds Zoom. It's a lightning fast counterattack. Another clean sheet, coach. Thanks to the sand trap. Hmm. Twisting Tiger's Cross was the first time anyone's broken through. If Sheik's find a way to get on the end of it, the whole sand trap collapses. But Sheik, I gave it my best. What more can I do? I'm sure you'll think of something, Duval. but we were so close to beating the Sand Trap. How about a header next time, El Matador? Tried that. Tiger, loop the cross in higher? Duval wins the ball in the air every time. Klaus, bicycle kick. No time to turn. And you said that one already. Give it up, Shakes. Yeah, get your butt cheeks off my car. I'm out of here. Sorry about this, Bruno. What are you lot still doing here? <laughs> Someone's a little obsessed with the Sand Trap. Hmm, you guys need to take a step back from the problem. Maybe what you need is a break. Time out? Oh, you're Say not what? kidding, are you? How about a stopover on the way to Dubai? Ever seen the pyramids? The pyramids? Going to Egypt? Yeah. <laughs> so sweet. Egypt, hey? The kind of place someone could get lost in. Margaret <laughs> Park! Totally blocked, dude. Can't wait to hit those dunes. Hit the dunes? Sandboarding shakes. It's the surfing of the desert. <laughs> Let's visit the pyramids first. They're full of snakes, booby traps, and mummies. Close, man. Egypt's greatest secrets are in its hieroglyphics, not silly myths. Please. What could be greater than Cleopatra's beauty secrets? Wild honey facials for everyone. No way. Sandboarding first. Museum. Music. Mummies. We can't do it all. There's not enough time. You can each do whatever you like today. <laughs> Just get to Dubai by tomorrow. <laughs> That's great. Oh, thanks, coach. And stay in touch on the group. What, what group? group? Not another Chatsky group. So many annoying messages. Come on. They even have Super Strikers GIFs. They're called GIFs, coach? Actually, it's pronounced GIFs. Who cares? Those memes are all so old. Okay, then. Best new meme of our day off win. <laughs> you guys are on. Get in, Shakes, man, before you get yourself run over. <laughs> Thank you for choosing Anubis Tours. Our first stop is no. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't pretend having Super Strikers on my tour isn't a big deal. It's a huge deal. My name is Salma, and I'll be your guide to wherever you want to go. Uh, can you suggest something involving mummies, for example? Or a museum with ancient artifacts and hieroglyphics? Hmm. I may know a place that'll suit you both. They've recently discovered the tomb of Pharaoh Nemesis III. It's still close to the public, but the archaeologist is my aunt. Maybe I can get you guys an exclusive tour. Hey, what about the rest of us? Yeah! Close to the public? We want in! Yeah, I also want to see the tomb. Because I love secret secluded places where you can just, you know, disappear. Sure, all aboard! <laughs> Welcome to the tomb of Pharaoh Nemesis III. It was customary to bury pharaohs with their most prized possessions. Accompaniments in the afterlife, you know? Isn't this fascinating, Klaus Ma? Mm. Salma's aunt is the real deal. Ah, uh, Professor Nasri, do you think we'll see any spitting cobras, mummies, tantalizing danger of any kind? <laughs> the only danger is Dr. Badawi, head of the Egyptian Relics Commission. He's constantly monitoring the tomb and the relics we find. He can be quite serious about the rules. So don't touch anything! 
ओके These hieroglyphics suggest this uncharted tunnel leads to the greatest treasures of the tomb. Incredible. Spears, trap doors. Wow. <clears throat> Careful kid, wouldn't want to get lost down there. Ah, new memes from the boys. Sandboarding radical. <laughs> Wild honey, hmm. my skin has uh. never felt ah! uh. fire ants. This place is too much. <laughs> I knew a break would do them good. And through here, we have the wall of secrets. <gasps> Hieroglyphics yet to be fully understood, but they suggest Whoa. there was more to ancient Egypt than science and art. Our ancestors also knew huh? how to have fun. Uh, this could be just what we need against the sand. Hey! <laughs> no flash photography. Huh? Urk. That's right. Urk, the Egyptian Relics Commission. I warned you. Artificial light damages the sensitive limestone at the walls, so no photos. <laughs> okay, okay. Sheesh. Hey, you don't mind if I borrow that, do you? <laughs> That soccer guy just took a picture of the hieroglyphics. What? I told you, no photo. But I, I, I didn't do anything. Then what's this? Uh, but the Relics Commission takes this sort of desecration very seriously, Mr. Soccer. <laughs> You'll have to explain this to the authorities. Let's go. I can't. I've got a game in Dubai in a couple of days. Not anymore. Not as long as I have this <laughs> as evidence. Huh? Hmm. Gotta show Tiger. Uh. Sorry, dude. What? Stop right there! Uh. Ah. 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 really didn't want anyone stealing his stuff. This way, Horace. Anyone seen Shakes? Oh, that soccer dude? He left ages ago. Huh, what? I suppose he didn't find it quite as fascinating as you did. It was fun, but, uh... No mummies? mummies. Would have been cool to at least see a trapdoor, a snake pit, or those balls that close in on you. I suppose that stuff really is just a myth. Well, well, Mr. Soccer. It seems your troubles have come to a head. Heads, you may win, Doc. But tails, you... <laughs> Horus, you big baby. Cleopatra's beauty secrets will be revealed. Anyone heard from Shakes? Nope, this is Shakes. This is Shakes when you add him to a Chatsky group. Not sure if Shakes is avoiding Chatsky. We're legitimately missing and we should be worried. Zabergo! Yeah, Shakes knows what he's doing. Ignoring Chatsky is the best way to live free. Whatever, dude. That's gotta be the most ancient relic I've seen all day. <laughs> Zabergo!
Huh? Why are we stopping here? Freddy Cat! Huh? No way! Sama! Shakes? Hey! You have a seaplane! Like I said, I'll take you Start and... Start the engine! Start the engine! Hey, dude. Need some help? Let's go! So far, I've managed to avoid my two least favorite things, chat skis and jet skis. So, are you going to tell me what this is all about? Well, it started at the tomb. Someone planted this photo on him. That Dr. Bodawi guy? guy? He was chasing me to these tunnels. Spears! Tractors! Ah! A human skull! A ravenous dog, dog on my heels! Hiding in a sarcophagus! Oh That's why I gotta practice, practice this, move this move and get to Dubai in time for the Sultan's game. Well, you just left Egyptian airspace. That's good, right? Yeah, now you're an international fugitive. <laughs> uh, actually, pull that thought. We're out of fuel! Gonna have to land this bird! How can you land on... Land. You know how we call camels the ships of the desert? Well, sand dunes are like the waves. <laughs> so North was right. Sandboarding is like surfing. Surfing on rocks? No. <laughs> ah, the Arabian Desert. So beautiful, yet so dangerous. Lucky for you, old Ben here's seen it all. Okay, that's new. <laughs> Shakes be like, <laughs> don't leave us. Chatsky auto removes you from a group if you take too long to check it. You in trouble? Guys, check this out. <laughs> now that's one hilarious may may. No, coach, it's real. That's crazy. Oh, man. You gotta help him. Yeah. yeah. But if we help him, we'd be party to the crime. The authorities would lock us up. Besides, how can we help him if we can't even find him? So all we can do is wait? Guys, it says here all he did was take a photo. He can't be in any real trouble. Four hours. Five at most. Horus, it seems our fugitives made some friends. Look, I figure it can work, but I still have to practice this move if we're gonna beat the sand trap. Also, I think my camel needs refueling. Or a nap. <laughs> Come on, we're nearly there. No ways. This is just what I need! Cool! I'll figure out how to get us to Dubai. Meet me down there in an hour. Great! See you there! <laughs> you do need a nap. Oh. And a breath mint. Uh, it's no good without the power cross. Huh. Mr. Sucker. Okay, Dr. Badawi. You got me. That's right. No one gets away from the Egyptian relics committee. Hey! <laughs> Not again, you look. Whoa! That is rather high. I'm keeping shakes in the lineup. 
If anything will draw him out of hiding, it's a football match. Good idea, coach. Shakes was onto something with twisting Tiger's power cross in the last game. Let's try that again. Strikers, it's up to you to get on the end of it. You got it, coach. He'll do it. For Shakes! Yeah! yeah. 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 For yeah. Shakes! Shakes. Well done on extending Sheikh's day off, Duval. Oh, I loved Egypt. I was one of the first people to see the tomb of Pharaoh Nemesis. Yeah, right, Stretch. It's still closed to the public. We are supposed to believe that? <laughs> I'll prove it. I've got photos. <sighs> okay, guys, here comes that power cross. Tiger, fire us it in! But the forwards just can't get onto it. Zoom pounces on Duval's clearance. He's too quick for Big Bo. And Sultan's punish Super Strikers for their mistake up front. <sighs> What's the use? There's no way we're gonna crack the sand trap. Hate to admit <sighs> it, huh? huh? Shakes! Where you been, we man? Were what happened to you? You need Cleopatra's beauty secrets. A crocodile egg to revitalize your hair. Saffron oil for your skin. And can someone get this man a fresh uniform? Here you go. Stop! I, I figured out how to beat the sand trap. Shakes! Captain, remember the tour? The ancient Egyptians didn't just master the arts and sciences. They also knew how to have fun. The hieroglyphics are amazing, Shakespeare. But what are you getting at? They played soccer in ancient Egypt. This is a move. Huh? Mm. Oh, come on, oh, man. No. Never gonna work. Trust me. All I need is Tiger's power cross. We tried that. Epic fail. Yeah. Gonna be a meme. They scored on the counter. It was pretty bad, Shakespeare. I told you I went on an exclusive tour with a fancy professor and everything. See? No, we can't see. Hold the photos lower, you dingbat. That's just some guy in a hat and glasses. Yeah, my hat and glasses. They're in my locker. <laughs> Shakes is back! And he's bringing new energy to the second half. But he'll need a lot more than enthusiasm to break through the sun trap, Brenda. Ah, that's the man. Arrest him. Super League Rule 7.94. Never interrupt a match. Come on, Tiger. You gotta do the power cross. You're not ready. You've missed four days of fitness training. <laughs> I've done all the fitness training. Do you have any idea how flexible you would need to be? Trust me, the last few days have really stretched me. <laughs> Sorry, Shakes. <sighs> Power Cross! Shakes, your move would take days of training. And that's with the proper support. Oh, I had support. <sighs> You learned a football move in the sea? Not exactly. Come on, let's go again. I think that's uh, enough. Again. Whoa! Okay, we're definitely done here. <coughs> again. Check. <laughs> again? Okay, Shakes. <gasps> but this is on you. Yes! Collapses like a house of cards. I think you mean a sandcastle, Matt. It it worked! Yeah, I left that one for you. <laughs> Shakes, you were right! Nice move, brother! Impressive, Shakes Mon! You totally owned it! Thanks, guys. Um, but I never told you how I got that photo. <sighs> Looks like it's time to face the music. Mr. Soccer. <laughs> Salma here has been doing a little detective work. Seems you are framed. 
That guy on our tour was Duval? Yep, I found all this stuff in his locker. We'll take those. This is a Super League matter now. Rule 52.374. Don't mess with your opponents on their day off. Coach, have you met- Met them? I've already added them to our Chatsky group. Float like a butterfly, kick like a scorpion. Classic! You and Salma totally win the challenge, Shakes, dude. <laughs> These new Maymays are hilarious. Uh, Coach, I think you'll find it's pronounced Mimi. Uh, because this one is me, this is me, me, me. Uh, this is just my toes dipped in goat's milk. Mimi, Mimi, Mimi. Yeah, Duval was totally in Egypt. What? Why does he get to do all the cool stuff? <laughs> Some guys have all the luck. Stop. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Del Aqua to the floating stadium. Come in, floating stadium. Yeah, we read you, boss. Loud and clear. Nothing to report down here. I'm coming back. No, wait! But guys, it's so rad! It says here the Austronesian people built it over a thousand years ago. Shakes, dude, I was amped for our trip to East Malaysia. Yeah, pretty cool place to anchor the floating stadium. But they have to listen to you riff on about these ruins all the way from Strikerland and get this. The ruins slipped onto the Pacific seabed during a massive earthquake. Make it stop! And now it's in a dry dome, so archaeologists can research it. Maybe we can convince Del Aqua to take us down there. Huh? Forget the lost legend shakes and focus on Super Striker's own living legend, El Matador! <clears throat> hey, even legends can have a one-off bad game. <sighs> Awkward. Fine. Three one-off bad games in a row. But my luck is about to change. Uh. Super Strikers! Some say a bird pooping on you is good luck. Really? Your problem has nothing to do with luck, El Meta Dude. Oh, please. Against Technicali, I laced my boots up using my Tuesday configuration. No wonder I played badly. Then, during the Cosmos game, I found out Ninja bought the same Lamborghini as me. No! no! You expect me to be able to concentrate on... Oh, yeah! Whoa! Oh, what is that, Mom? A whale farting, maybe? No, that's the air from the dome. They purge it when oxygen levels get too low. Then suck fresh air back down there, so our team of archaeologists can continue unlocking the secrets of the ruins. Coach Del Aqua? Ahoy there! <laughs> Let's get you settled in. So, what were the ruins built for? It's an amphitheater. Public meetings, perhaps? Mm. Celebrations? Entertainment? And how long can someone stay down there at a time? Only 30 minutes before the dome floods and the air automatically purges. Whoa! The moon pool room. Uh, that's right. It's the base of our ruins operation. That's where you launch the aquapods from. Simon to the moon pool room, Simon to the moon pool room. Self-decompressing, solar-powered, max depth 200 meters, right? Wow, you really do know your stuff, Shakes. Yeah, all thanks to the nerd manual. Good old National Aquatic. Every last detail, hey? So, any chance we get to go down there? What does it say in your manual? Uh, archaeologists only? We must do all we can to preserve such a precious archaeological site. That's why we have Simon here. What's up, Mr. Del Aqua, sir? Simon is in charge of Moonpool security today. But I was hoping to watch the game. Oh, you can still watch the game. Match day at the floating stadium. Oh, so close to the action, but so far. Yeah. I know how you feel. What a spectacular setting for this Super League doubleheader, Matt. Indeed, Brenda. Off the coast of East Malaysia and above mysterious ruins. Get me the ball, guys. I'm feeling lucky. Yes! El Matador sets his sights on the Hydra goal. Just 
just my luck. What do you mean? I'm on the verge of breaking my dry spell, and Hydra come up with some impenetrable defense. Come on, El Matador. Enough with the excuses. The only person responsible for your form is you. Hydra take the first encounter by only a narrow margin. And despite being surrounded by water, El Matador's drought continues. <sighs> Can this day just end, please? Yeah, easier said than done. This is crazy. Oh. Delacqua may be at the forefront of research at sea. Yeah, but he sure ain't at the forefront of comfort at sea. <laughs> Guys, please, we need to be rested for practice tomorrow. Don't worry, Captain. I've been reading up on the science of sleep. Hit yeah, what yes, you got? Please. Method one, sleep in your socks. Research shows warm feet mean better sleep. <sighs> I guess it's worth a shot. Wow, Klaus, your sleep science actually works. Yep, I feel good as new. What did I tell you guys? Vlog, vlog. Okay, okay, Block, we try something different tonight, yeah? Right. I have three ways to get us some goals against Hydra. Over the top. Come on, Shakes. Run it the in. nerd manual isn't going to help us beat Hydra, mm -hmm. okay? But first up, we're going to create space in the middle by using Shakes and El Matador as decoys. <gasps> decoys? But then how? How I... do you break your dry spell? Your dry spell is our dry spell. We break it together. Me? A decoy? No. I'm a glorious gold getter, a stylish sharpshooter. I am not a decoy. Huh? Heads up, sleepyhead. <laughs> Sorry, North dude. Water, perhaps? Whoa, <laughs> grub. What a loser. Can't score any goals. Bird poop on me. At least I still have my glorious hair to... <sighs> so beautiful, huh? Hydra players in the Nerd Dome? <coughs> Guys, I, I think I know how Hydra are stopping me from scoring goals. Let me guess. You forgot to wear your lucky underpants? You put your boots on the wrong feet? Is it because it's full moon or something? No, 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 guys, listen! El Matador, change your clothes and your attitude, or you're on the bench tomorrow. Method two, listening to soothing sounds will put you right to sleep. Huh. Makes me want to go surfing. Makes me want to go to the toilet. Hey, anyone seen my National Aquatic? Oh, shut up, everybody, and go to sleep, please! So, tomorrow we can implement our team-oriented strategy against Hydra. <clears throat> Archaeologists only, my butt. Okay, so I grab a submarine thingy, zip down to the door. Ah! Shut, shut up! up! Why the sudden interest in the nerd dome? I uh, discovered a new sleep technique. Reading about boring old ruins. <gasps> okay, confession. Doodling helps me sleep. Hmm. Get out of the pod, El Matador. No, Shakes. I figured out how Hydra beat us. 
So get out of the pod and we can talk about it. The reason their defense is so good is because they've been training down there. Wow, that is a crazy excuse for playing badly. Even by your standards. It's not an excuse, Chase. You heard Delacqua. Only archaeologists are allowed in the dome. That's all lies. Anyone can go down there. <laughs> 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 with this crazy idea. When I fell into the water, I saw Hydra players in the dome. You're telling me Delacqua has intentionally misled the whole world so he can use an ancient Austronesian ruin as a training pitch? Yeah, except it's more of an ancient Austronesian training machine. of oxygen. You have 15 minutes of oxygen. Only 15 minutes? Good thing we didn't bring the whole team down, right? Whoa! <laughs> You're right. I know. Looks like Del Aqua didn't tell National Aquatic everything. Goal posts! Field markings. And defenders. And soccer balls. How about we do some research of our own? We figure out a way past these stones. We figure out how to beat Hydra. And I break my gold drought once and for all. Do the honors. It will be my pleasure. of oxygen. Okay, time to get out of here. Come on, Chase. We've almost got it. <laughs> huh? Initiating air purge. <laughs> yeah. We need to get out of here. Now. <laughs> <laughs> Chase, please tell me you know what to do. I haven't finished reading. <laughs> 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 I guess that's the first truly aquatic, national aquatic! <gasps> A dream! Oh, that's all! Ah! Dude, get up! We overslept! Hey, looks like method two worked a charm! Tonight, method three! <laughs> Research shows having a caregiver watching over you makes you sleep easier! Listen up, boys! Tonight, we sleep! <gasps> Hi, coach! Bye, coach! You two have some explaining to do! You remember the plan, right? Yeah, I know what to do! And there's these crazy stone circles that move back and forth. But for real, they're like actually defenders. And it's kind of like playing against Hydra, but... Whoa, 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 El Matador. And you, Shakes? What did you see down there? Well, the dome purged as I arrived. But it just looked like beautiful ruins to me. What? So, you only went down there to save El Matador's hide? Yeah, I was scared he'd get stuck. Oh, Shakes, you're such a hero. Seems your attitude hasn't changed at all, El Matador. You know the deal. Ah! The bench? Please, coach! Not the bench! Great performance, El Matador. Next step, convince coach. Much 
huge day at the floating stadium. <sighs> and El Matador is on the bench. Simon, why not watch this game for real? Really, Coach Delacqua? Yes. I think our little security threat has been eliminated. El Matador's on the bench, and his body language speaks volumes, Mac. Looks to me like it's still saying, dry spell. Okay, boys. The decoy. Okay, over the top. All right, run it in. So, you were right about Hydra modeling their defense on the ruins. I know. But, Shakes, you said we that... We couldn't let Delacqua know what we saw in the dome, Coach. And we needed me on the bench. Let me guess. So you can go down there and figure out a way through the stones. Yep. But won't Delacqua notice if El Matadude's not there in the second half? Klaus has that covered. Yeah. Uh, I do? Hydra have fended off every Super Striker's attack so far. The coach is sticking to his game plan. El Matador is still on the bench. Aye, and his body language is even worse than it was in the first half. Seems the once great <laughs> striker has given up on breaking his dry spell. You have 30 minutes of oxygen. Strikers build the pressure by pushing players forward. But the higher the pressure, the quicker the release. Super Strikers rush back to defend. No! Oh, it's too late! No! Yeah, no kidding. I can almost smell the whale fart. <clears throat> Correction. Huh? You have 30 seconds of oxygen. One minute divided by you. Please, Mr. Matador, put the pickaxe down, okay? No. Yes. No. Yes. <gasps> no. Initiating air purge. Help! Don't worry. I've done this before. <laughs> Who's finally off the bench, Brenda? Much more positive body language from El Matador. And did your crazy plan work? I have a theory, but there's only one way to test it. Get you the ball. <laughs> Could there be any other way? Last ditch effort from Coach sending on El Matador. I can't imagine moping around on the bench has done anything for his form, Brenda. All you, El Matador. El Matador. Oh, yeah. Come on. What are you waiting for? Perfect moment. Just shoot! And now.
be sending a few, um, updates through to National Aquatic. Yeah, soon the secrets of the ruins will be accessible to everyone. Simon? Simon! You're off Moon Pole security. Forever! <gasps> Two goals in one game? What a return to port for El Matador! Ah. So, El Matador, you finally broke your dry spell. Sure. But the really important thing is that we won. Just kidding! I broke my dry spell! I broke my dry spell! <laughs> hey, uh, could I borrow your hair dryer? My National Aquatic needs a drying spell. <laughs> yeah. Not funny. I'm really looking forward to getting some rest. Method three, here we go. I don't think that'll be necessary. Turns out the best way to get to sleep is soccer. <laughs> Am I right, Klaus? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's time now to recognize this season's greatest moments of sportsmanship with the Super League Fair Play Awards. Our first nominee is Nakama's star striker and a true man of honor, Miko Chen! Brussels sprout? Next up, from Barca FC, known for his friendly vibes on and off the field, Riano! Huh? Uh -huh. And our final nominee, whose charisma uh -huh. and noble spirit have captured the hearts of fans and players alike, uh -huh. Shakes! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Huh? Uh -huh. And finally, public misuse of a meatball at a Super League event. Shakes and Scara are hereby sentenced to a six-month ban. What? Order. You're banning my Star Striker a week before we play Super Strikers? Order! With respect, Your Honor, six months is a long time, and it won't solve the conflict between the players. You didn't let me finish. The sentence is a six-month ban, or we can try something a little more experimental. In extreme cases, the disciplinary board has used a specialized institute to achieve more dramatic results. A Swiss institute? They are impartial, clinical, and highly effective. All arrangements have been made. However, we can't move forward until you approve their treatment plan. We're listening. You two got lucky. The judge reduced your sentence from a six-month ban to a week of conflict resolution. I guess that's good news, but what about practice? The Derby's in a week. We can't say any more. It's all up to you guys now. Play nice, okay? Thought you two'd never wake up. Are we in Switzerland yet? Nope. We're flying over one of the world's last protected rainforests. Miles and miles of uninhabited wilderness. Wow. Uh, who are you? I'm Nisha from the Swiss Institute. Hey, uh, Nisha, what's that for? Oh, that's just one of our collaboration tools. Ah, a little back and forth passing, eh? Well, it's not quite that simple. You have to keep it in motion for 12 hours straight. Sounds simple to me. Hey, you can't just put it in a handbag and go for a walk. You must make boot contact at least every 10 seconds or the ball shuts down and they revert to the six month ban. Huh? Uh, they'll explain everything at the Institute. I've said too much already. Yeah, how about you stick to flying the plane? Take it easy, Prince Charming. We're only here because you started a food fight. You deserved it after what you did to get your precious fair play award. Whatever, dude. I was just trying to help. <laughs> I hate to interrupt. We have a problem. Huh? We're gonna have to jump. What? <gasps> no way. Just do what she says. Don't lecture me. Oh. Uh oh. Uh, mind if 
to borrow this? Sarah, hey! Whoa! Got any spare parachutes? Mayday, mayday. Oh. We're losing out. Bail out! Bail out! Bail out! I know some of you will see our next fixture as a grudge match. Uh-huh. Well, yeah. It kinda is. Invincible United is going down. Especially after what their captain did to the Klaus dude in that food fight. What? Ah, my lip! That pesky ball, not allergy. <laughs> Guys. Our approach will be cool and professional, combining the four fundamentals of football. Skills, training, strategy, and teamwork. So what about Shakes? The brother's still on the team, right? That is entirely up to him. Would be nice to still include him in our game plan. Ta-da! It's Shake Dummy, just like the real thing. Not quite. <laughs> Even better than the real thing. Ha! Nice landing! Whoa! Stupid tree! Whoa! This wilderness is pretty wild. And a long way from Switzerland. Guess we'll be missing the Darby after all. Come on, if we can get to the plane, we've still got a chance. The plane? Which has a radio and is exactly the reason I was going to suggest we go there. So Vince, I assume you've got some kind of plan for the Darby. Yeah, what are we going to do about Skara? Don't worry, boys. I've dealt Skara a perfect hand. And if he plays his cards right, we'll crush Super Strikers this weekend. I really miss him. <laughs> and all the funny names he calls me. <laughs> no one said you could speak, Dingus. Yeah, shut your pie hole, you big dope. That's so sweet, you guys. But it's just not the same. Bad idea, dude. These make you fart like crazy. <laughs> Not me. it all falls apart without number four, teamwork. Yeah, the whole team. Pulling together as one, no man left behind. Relax, huh? guys. You don't need me. El Matador will score all the goals. Ah! No sign of the pilot. Misha, she made it out in time. Maybe she went for help. I wouldn't count on it. You're right. We still need to get a signal out. How about we set these alight? Hilarious. Besides, this whole crash site's a smoke signal and no one's come for us yet. What we need is something like... Huh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so much for airplane mode. Aha! Food! This will be useful. Stop the party, Shakes. Think I just found our ticket out of here. The Swiss Institute ball? If they can track data in the ball, maybe they can use it to track our location. Not bad, dude. Great. Let's kick this thing off. Wait, Whoa. wait, wait. Remember what Nisha said. If it stops for more than 10 seconds, the ball shuts down, and they won't be able to track us. Yeah, yeah. What's your point? We have to nail this the first time. We're tired now. No chance we'll keep the ball moving for 12 hours straight. We can start tomorrow at first light. Nuh uh. No way I'm spending a night in that plane with you. There's just no way. Hey, so, real talk. Why'd you throw that meatball at me the other night? 
Ugh. I mean, the Brussels sprout I can understand. It's small, round, smells like a burp. I mean, who eats Brussels sprouts? It's like they're designed to be thrown. But a meatball? Come on, man. Those things are delicious. Hey, can you keep your whining down to a low grumble? I'm trying to sleep. Was it my fair play nomination, or, or was it because of what happened in the game? What you want from me, man? Yeah, I had a shot at winning that game, but I screwed it up. That's it, the end. So if you're trying to create some sappy moment where I tell you I admire your fair play reputation and wish I could be more like you, and then we realize we're more similar than we ever thought and should actually be best pals, forget it. I'm not that guy, and this isn't that moment. Fasten your seatbelts, we're heading into turbulence! What? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Whoa, it, the ball's moving. Why is it still counting? Boot contact! Quick! Sheesh. This won't be easy, but if we work together... Don't worry. I got you. Nice juggling. Too bad you joined the Super League. You could have been a world-class circus clown. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, we got our boots mixed up. Let's swap back. Sure. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> On second thought, let's keep it going. Yeah, and maybe you take the first shift. Okay. I'm going to do a supply check. The terrain's pretty rough around here. We need level ground, open space. All we got are water biscuits and some canned turnips and gravy. <laughs> pretty dry for <coughs> water biscuits. <laughs> Ugh, smells like a wet tennis ball. <laughs> Man, just think of all that awesome grub we threw away in the food fight. That was some luxury cuisine we wasted. Meh, totally worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you, bro? <laughs> what did you call me that day? Oh, yeah. Moron. Numbskull. Frog-faced. Dumpster fart. That was a good one. The mobile phone you have called is not available. Still no answer from Shakes. The judge warned us about that. The Institute confiscates phones. It's nothing to worry about. Just think, guys. What would Shakes say if he was here? Ha! I've got the perfect thing. My new voice mimic app. Come on, guys. I've got an idea. Come on, guys. I got an idea. Ooh, I That's classic Shakes. Shakes. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, don't worry, coach. I got this. Don't worry, coach. I got this. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Trust me. Trust me. I figured it I out. I figured it out. Watch this. I knew it. El Matador is the greatest. What? He says that a lot. <laughs> like, a lot, a lot. Incoming. And back to you. Hey, look! There's a clearing! That should make the whole keep the ball moving thing easier for you. I mean, us. Eight hours to go. But we need to find another way around. What if a train comes while we're crossing? There'll be nowhere to go. Come on, Shakes. Don't wuss out on me now. Trains are like payphones and CDs. Sure, they exist. But nobody uses them anymore. Huh. I bet there hasn't been a train on these tracks for years. Please tell me you just ate some more berries. I'm good. Could use a little help, though.
Just like payphones and CDs, huh? All right, all right. You saved my butt back there. What do you want? Another fair play award? So that is what's been bugging you. Hey, I'm pretty shaken up from that close call. Would you mind? Thanks, bro. So, you ever gonna tell me what's going on? Where's all this hostility coming from? Uh, you really wanna know. It's not about the goal I missed, or how everyone laughed at me. It's not even about the stupid fair play award. What bothers me is your attitude. My attitude? You know what I mean, that thing you do. Oh, look at me, I'm the poster boy for good sportsmanship. I don't eat poison berries. I know all about trains and I always do the right thing. You're mad because I helped you up? I'm mad because you think you're better than me. I don't think I'm better than you. To be honest, when you're not around, I don't think of you at all. The signal. You called it. Nice one, Skara. Duh. Nisha? You're all right. Well done. You've completed the challenge. Huh? Yeah, so the plane didn't really crash. What? <laughs> Standard procedure. Deploy fake engine smoke, drop the passengers, and fly low behind a mountain while your team rigs a replica crash site. Which brings us to this. Uh, you boys get along okay? Well... Are you kidding? Two days of bro bonding in the wild? We're best buds now. Glad to hear it. Your coaches were willing to try anything to avoid the six-month ban. They were in on it? Oh, <laughs> those sly coaches. We had fun though, right, buddy? Fun? Dude, you... you... Oh, forget it. Can we please just go home? Hmm. Match day at Striker Land. Invincible United take on the men in red for a place at the top of the table. But after some off-field controversy... You mean that epic food fight, Brenda? Super Strikers have left their leading goal scorer on the bench. Coach, Skara and I really did try to work together. Why are we still being punished? Huh? <laughs> Skara isn't being punished, Jinx. What? Just you. But, but why? After your dismal effort in the jungle, you're lucky to still be on the squad. My dismal effort? The Super League recommended a full pardon for him and a couple of games on the bench for you. And I agree. Ah, oh, but... Keep your emotions in check, Shanx. That's what got you into trouble in the first place. <sighs> it's just not going to be the same without him. Who? That ridiculous airbag with a broom for hair? Or the shakes, dummy! <laughs> With shakes, without shakes, we're still gonna crush it. Yeah, makes no difference to us. And they're off! The Derby always brings out the best in these hometown rivals. And no one enjoys the competition more than Scar on that. Perhaps not today, Brenda. final minutes of the game and there's still no score despite both teams playing their hearts out. The only one not pulling his weight out there is Skara. At least Skara's having a terrible game. Seems without you, he's got nothing to play for. Ugh, it's so unfair. Just look at him standing there like a waste of space. No point making it personal, Shakes. Personal? Of course it's personal. Skara's vendetta against me is personal. And I personally worked very hard to connect with him and keep that ball moving through the jungle. I know you didn't, Shakes. Huh? Your boots. What about my boots? <sighs> I wasn't supposed to tell you this, but the Institute measured your contributions to the challenge according to boot contact with the ball. That snake! He was wearing my boots! But how did Skara know they were tracking our boots? 
He knew because Vince wasn't taking notes. He was writing instructions. You're right, Shakes. This is personal. And the fact you did all the work in the jungle might just pay off. Shakes is on the pitch. And Scala looks... Mm, thrilled. Hey, you told the judge you were benching that brat. I hope you brought your pen and paper. You might want to take notes. Shakes is off and firing on all cylinders. Ooh, it's a loose ball. I got it. Finally, Scara springs to life. You made me keep possession for 12 hours straight. I think I can handle a few more seconds. Now that Shakes has the ball back... He's not sharing it with anyone. And the men in red win the derby with a sensational goal in the final minute. So? You still prefer the Shakes dummy? Nah, can't beat the real thing. <laughs> Always bounces back. Yup, every time. I've seen pirate captains with more I discipline. I dare you to say that again! Shakes wasn't even on the field, and you still couldn't score! Don't blame me. This whole thing was your idea! Oh, come on, guys. Stay out of this, you flop your bozo, you big dunce, you... You boneheaded, pigeon toed butt scratching ignoramus! Mm. If village idiots had their own village, you'd be their king! And what's with the band aid? Is that from when the doctor removed your brain? I and Tank were dominating. Yeah, if we didn't have Block, he would have destroyed us. Burger, burger. Too bad they didn't destroy that shirt he's wearing. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, come on. Oh, no, this is not going to be good for my hair. What's going on, guys? Bad news, dude. It's 40 degrees in Dubai. Whoa. Sultans thrive in the heat. When they play at home, no one can stop them. <sighs> Come on, we beat Iron Tank in the cold, we'll beat Sultans in the heat. No, you won't. I'm calling the game off. You're oh, no. Come again. Super League Extreme Conditions Clause. If the temperature exceeds 35 degrees, the match can be postponed. Come on, how bad can it be? See, it's actually kind of cool here. Nice try, Shakes. Postpone the game. But we've come all this way. Fans are gonna be bleak. Wait, coach, your sources must be mistaken because the world's bravest weatherman, Sonny Hailstrom, has a different prediction. <laughs> if you're lucky enough to be watching Celtics versus Super Strikers at Goliath Stadium tomorrow, it'll be a comfy 25 degrees. Ah, Wait, what? One minute it's 40. And now it's 25. You better believe it. You better believe it. <laughs> he always says that. Sunny Hallestrom? Is he even a meteorologist? Doesn't he just, you know, read the cue cards? Well, his predictions are never wrong. And he's not afraid of anything. Yeah, check it out. I've got to warn you folks, stay indoors. This hailstorm, thunderstorm, tropical cyclone is extremely dangerous. To go out in this weather, you'd have to be a moron. Legend. Moron. Oh, oh, not cool. No man. way, it's huh? 25. Oh, oh, oh. Talk about a home ground advantage. A warm welcome to the Goliath, Super Strikers. <laughs> Aircon. Aircon! 
on. My hair can't take this heat. There's no need to worry about your hair, Mr. Matador. Why do you agree with me, Sheik? 40 degrees is too hot for football. Oh, we won't have to call off the game, coach. We've made other arrangements. So Sonny was right. Maybe he's not a moron. But how could he have known? Because huh? it's my job to know. <laughs> Sonny Hellstrom, at your weather service. <laughs> Sonny will monitor the temperature throughout our first air-conditioned match. Whoa. I knew you'd become a Sonny fan, Shakes. Not him, Strudelhead. The Goliath is amazing. <laughs> uh, fancy a little tool. Oh, oh, yeah. Looks early. Oh, oh. Sure. Absolutely. Oh. <laughs> Welcome aboard the Goliath Sky Train. You are on the Arch Tour. Giant cogs close the roof, sealing Goliath off from the harsh desert conditions. Our highly trained temperature curators constantly monitor and maintain our state-of-the-art system. Hot and cold air ducts along the arch allow us to create the perfect climate for playing professional football. Ah, just the way me and my hair like it. Oh yes, the height of luxury is control. You had me oh, a so giant car. I play sweet. <laughs> Sorry, I always do that with first-timers. How's this for a bird's-eye view of the world's most luxurious stadium? You want to know a secret, Shakes? I still get scared out in those tropical storms. But the thing about fear is, if you don't face it, it gets worse. <sighs> A tour. This stadium is next level. Sheik, you are always upgrading. Yeah, but now how can you make Goliath any bet? Oh, so nice. beautiful! <laughs> I guess the height of luxury is. Control. <laughs> See you at kickoff tomorrow, Super Strikers. <laughs> Day at Goliath Stadium. The first match with the Sheik's new aircon. And to measure the temperature during the game, we have the world's bravest weatherman, Sonny Hellstrom. Big fan, Mac? Nah. Medium size at best, Brenda. Now remember, if the conditions get too extreme, the match can be called off. Well, folks, thanks to its remarkable cooling system, Goliath is a comfortable 25 degrees. And you... you better believe it! Ooh, can Sultans make an early impression on this game? Not if the Super Striker's defense can help it. Lock shows incredible composure under pressure. Oh, and now the men in red have some space in the midfield. <laughs> Cracking shot! Conditions at the Goliath are giving both teams a fair chance. Handled 
this much longer. My hair can't handle this much longer. Come on, Rev. It's clearly hotter than 25 degrees. Another reading, please, Mr. Hillstrom. Uh... Still a comfy 25 degrees, folks. But, um, I suppose it is a little better. Losing your cool, coach? Or just losing? <laughs> I love it here at the Goliath. What are you talking about? We're one nil down. Still, lol. All because Goliath's cooling system doesn't work as advertised. Yeah, now we know why it's called Air Con. Ooh, look at my fancy air-conditioned stadium. Does he think we're stupid? That's it. I'm going up to that control room. Out of the question, Shakes. The ref's made his decision. You said it yourself, Shakes man. We can beat Sultans in the heat, but we got to stick together. You know what's stuck together? My butt cheeks are stuck together. Yeah. Oh, man, yeah, I so hear you. Sweaty. My brain is melting. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's got the smoothest hair of all? El Mata, huh? <gasps> Shakes, brother, where's your mind at? <laughs> you left your shower running. Uh. Hmm. I'll just borrow a little shimmer mousse from Shakes. That guy's hair is a lost cause anyway. Super Strikers are looking strong after the break. But can they keep it up? Mm. I'm on to you, Sheik. What's behind your back? What are you doing, Sheik's man? Forget him. No, Captain. I figured it out. Control is the greatest form of luxury. What are you talking about? The Sheik. He's getting away. Sheik's man. Warm up, Klaus. But I'm already warm, coach. Then get out there! Very clever, Sheik. Controlling the temperature to give your team the advantage. So sorry. What do you mean, Sheiks? Now you're gonna turn it down and have Sonny tell us it's still a comfy 25 degrees. Ah, uh, you got me. But unfortunately, now... It's completely out of my hands! <laughs> hmm, a little more bravado than I anticipated. 40 degrees? Are you nuts? You said it would stay 25! Guaranteed! That's an additional complication. Shakes has the controller. Oh, he'll turn it down, obviously. <laughs> You think he'll just take it down to 25? Please. He might prefer 21. Or even 19. But you'll be exposed. But a fraud. But a laughing stock. My reputation. You'd better believe it. Come on, Shakes. We can still win this. Welcome aboard the Goliath Sky Train. Yes. You are on the roller coaster tour. It's a little warmer.
warmer than Sunny says, Mac. Tell me about it, Brenda. Well, the heat certainly suits Sultans. Yes! <sighs> All right. Over to you guys. All right. Time to pick up the pace. Yes, it's working. Huh? Sunny, what are you doing? Quickly, Shakes. Let me in! <laughs> Thank you. That was foolish. Foolish? Then what do you call helping the Sheik with your false temperature readings? Please, I would never risk my reputation by giving a false report. But now that you and the Sheik are playing silly games, I have no choice but to take back control. some classic moves. They can make it look so easy. is over, Shakes, and we're heading into an early fall. Uh, there! Just take it, you weirdo! Ha-ha! Huh? Ah. You! The world trusted you, Sonny. And that's why... I need you to be a good boy and hand over that controller. I can't believe people rely on you for the weather. You're the worst weatherman ever. How dare you? Did you hear something? Like someone screaming for help from far, far away? Hmm. Nah. You know, you're wrong about me. People don't just want the weather shakes. They want to know they'll be okay. Ice storms, tornadoes, gale force winds. In the end, they just want to know they'll be safe. So you see, I'm not just a weatherman. I give people peace of mind. over with. <laughs> yes, block! Oh, ha -ha. My weather reports make people happy, Shakes. And no snot-nosed little soccer star is going to take that away from me. Nice speech, Sonny. What are you doing, Shakes? You know, the thing about fear is... Huh? If you don't face it... No! No, Shakes! Don't! It gets worse. Ah! This one's for messing with my hair! Little too late, Super Strikers. Huh? Ah, 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 ah. 
legend. Huh? No. No. No! Guys, to the tunnel! This the only way is to open the dome! Well, we'll do it! Uh, yeah. Match postponed due to extreme conditions. But the scoreboard, how did you... You know what they say around here. The height of luxury is control. <sighs> Look on the bright side, Sheik. Your stupid golf cart. It survived. <sighs> hey, guys. So, has anyone seen Sunny? <laughs> Hi, folks. Uh, I guess my reading was a little off. <laughs> but at least that storm made things a lot more exciting, mm -hmm. right? You're the worst! Totally lame! You couldn't predict your own fart! Wait, no! Listen, I... I can still fix this! Oh, my career is over! You'd better believe it! What did I tell you, dude? <laughs> okay, guys, let's get out of here! Blog of Zagalag, Blog Zag! Weekend. How do you plan to celebrate? In the 25 years since Grimm joined the Super League, we have developed a reputation for showmanship. Yeah! Yeah! So, we can think of no better way to celebrate than by playing Super Strikers. Strikers. Because your first Super League match was against the men in red? Precisely. They beat you 2-0 back then. That would definitely dampen the celebrations. Oh, this time we plan to reverse that scoreline. For Grimm! For Grimm! Gotta love that grim spirit. But two new? No way. Yeah, not with our three striker formation, right, guys? Totally, Shakes. Just get me the ball and I'll score the goals. Come on. If anyone should get the credit, it's Big Bo. Without his rock solid goalkeeping, we couldn't all play forward. Give me a B for Big Bo. He's the hero of this song. And besides his awesome keeping, he's also very strong. Come on, Big Bo. Aren't you excited to be roomies? Well, I did bring noise-canceling headphones to block out all the humming, singing, and incessant talking. Whoa, oh, thanks, Big Bo. Uh, Don't look at me, brother. I've done my time. He once sang me a lullaby all through the night. Klaus, I'm going to need those back. Whoa, so quiet. Perfect for composing new chants. <laughs> give me a B, give me an I, give me a G, B, O. <laughs> Oh, it's you two. You know who is here, in the crowd. As I expected. Well, try not to cause a fuss. 
See what I do to Big Bo, they'll be begging me to come back. Welcome to the castle, Super Strikers, where we treasure everything grim. From our countless trophies and the Tactinomicon, to our beloved cauldron and the infamous ghost train. Question, does the ghost train contain any actual ghosts? Grim may have a reputation for being haunted, but that's all superstition. Finally, we have the Hall of Heroes. Batbear, the bright. Nogden, the not so bright. Tim, tiny face Dubinsky. And Neville. Neville? His dad paid for the cauldron. But let me tell you about the man who built the cauldron. Legend has it that when the pitch was laid, the cauldron's groundsman came across a stone of peculiar shape. Though many tried, no man could lift it. None. But Mislav Markovich. Whoa. Whoa. Dude, shred it. Awesome. Ah. That's going on matter. I'm making my own Hall of Heroes. <laughs> Where's the stone now? Some say it was lost when the cauldron was revamped. Others say it never existed. Uh, Coach Belmont, it looks like someone's been removed from the Hall of Heroes. Everything even associated with Spike Dawson is strictly banned from these grounds. Whoa. Heavy. But... He deserved it. Yeah. Right, Big Bo? I've moved on. I'm sure Spike has too. This disguise, our fancy dress costume, was useless. Please accept our apology, sir. You can have another one on the house. What else you got? Mort! What you got? Sorry, Mr. Dawson. All the other costumes are booked out for the big game. What about... Hey, why are these in the bargain bin? That's the garbage bin. Ah! Here I am with the perfect plan to help Grim beat Super Strikers, but I can't get my message to Big Bo because my only way past security is a pink bunny suit! Why don't you just call him? Huh, nice cover. <laughs> yeah, we have costumes for everything, even phones. Nope, those are for display purposes only. All we've got left is this. You know what? I'll take it! And the bunny suit! Hey! For Grim! For Grim. Can you at least deliver this peace offering to Big Bo for me? Ah! <laughs> If I can't go through security, I'll go under it. No one knows these grounds like old Spike. <laughs> Cooler than a cucumber and sharper than a cactus, Zero runs his number because he likes to practice. So let's go, Big Bo. Good luck for the game. Thanks, Klaus. Oh, hey, where's the fruit come from? Huh? If it wasn't you, then... The cauldron is haunted! Dawson. Hmm. A simple thank you would suffice. What do you want, Spike? I want you to understand how important this game is to Grim. Grim wants nothing to do with you. Oh, that'll change when I tell everyone your secret. What secret? Ever since you injured your wrist a few years well, ago. Uh, I'm sure Klaus doesn't want to hear about that. My secret. And soon, so will everyone in the Super League. What? I'm gonna post it on Natter. Fine. What do you want me to do? I'm gonna take you on a little tour. At the end, there'll be a question. Get it right, and I'll cancel the post. <sighs> Where do we start? Pull on the candle holder. <laughs> oh. Um... Not that one. Whoa! Big bow? <gasps> Big Bo is a ghost? It's time for the real Grim Tour. Right. First up, calling the stadium the cauldron. 
That was my idea. And eating all those ice lollies? Also your idea. Maybe. Next up is the famous ghost train. My idea. And finally, Grim FC's legendary showmanship. Your idea. My idea! <laughs> has tried to erase my legacy, but you can't rewrite history! So, who's responsible for making Grimm the club it is today? Um, Neville? Careful now, Big Bo! All right, it's Spike Dawson! You bet your life it's Spike Dawson! So, are we done? Oh, there will be two more lessons! Answer the banana within three rings, or the post goes live! Wait, how do I get out of here? Oh. Huh? Hmm, back at the Hall of Heroes. Third Striker coming through! <laughs> yeah, the three striker formation is rocking, dudes! Well, it's easy when there's no one to stop the ball. Klaus? Huh? Where's Big Bo? I don't know, Coach. He disappeared. Just like a girl. Sorry I'm late, Coach. I got a little lost. All right, well... Let's get on with it. Yes! The three striker formation is working great! It's not our fault we've got the best goalie in the Super League. Yeah, as long as he doesn't disappear again. Uh huh? Big bow. The guy could stop a freight train. He could catch an aeroplane. Isn't that? Uh, 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 get back, ghost of shakes! It's me, dude. Big bow's gone missing. Again. Step onto the plate, big bow. The skull stone? Huh? Come on, Spike. If you want to play footy, just ask. Oh, we're playing a game called What It Feels Like to Be Spike. Uh... Weighed down by the burden of unrealized talent, I couldn't move forward. Instead, I spent my time watching and re-watching every game you played. I noticed something everyone else missed. How good I look in tights? Your weakness! In five minutes, that cannon will fire. Save the gold, or I release your secret! And if I can't lift the stone? Then you'll stay down there and be forgotten, just like they forgot old Spike. This means you post my secret on Natter. Not if you've learned your lesson. Whose career did you destroy? Oh. Say it! Spike Dawson. Correct. All right, what's my final challenge? Oh, I'm saving that for tomorrow. But tomorrow's the game! <laughs> So, you think Big Bo is a ghost? I know he's a ghost! But he is alive, yes? How'd he suddenly become a ghost? Maybe he was touched by another ghost! I don't think that's how ghosts work. You're thinking of vampires, Klaus! And werewolves. And zombies. You're telling me those monsters can make other monsters, but ghosts can't make other ghosts? Enough it is. There's no such thing as go- Ghost! <laughs> Not a ghost. We were worried about you, brother. Yeah, where have you been? And why are you wet? You sure you want to know? Of course, Come dude. on, we're yes. brothers. Oh. A few years ago, I injured my wrist against the upright. It wasn't long before I was back in goal, but Spike had made it his mission to watch my every move. 
And eventually, he figured out my weakness. What weakness? Yeah, you are the best. Whenever I dive low to my left, I hesitate. About one in three shots goes in. <laughs> now, unless I do what Spike says, he'll put my secret out on Natter. You'll be a soft target for the Grim Strikers tomorrow. We'll be lucky if the scoreline is only 2-0. That's scarier than you being a ghost, Big Bo. Hey, we're always counting on you, Big Bo. But tomorrow, you can count on us. Yeah, we'll score a bunch of goals. Let's, Let's do it. Yeah. We got you, Big That'll Bo. take the pressure off. Yeah. Give me a beat. Nope. Match night at the Cauldron. As usual, the Grim fans have really got into the spirit of the occasion. And so have the commentators. Right, Mac? Well, I hate to be outdone, Brenda. Too late. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> hmm. <laughs> Guys, footy isn't about how you look. It's about how I look. <laughs> If you see this man, report it to security. Spike Dawson. That weirdo. Some guys just don't know when to quit. Tonight, Venetuvia is like a ghost town. Because everyone's at the cauldron. Yeah, everyone except me. Thanks for nothing, Belmont. Wow, those masks are getting pretty good. <sighs> Gone to the game. Duh. Hm, a little rude. <laughs> yes. Perfect. The first half draws to a close as Super Strikers turn up the heat. But the home team stays cool under pressure. At this stage, uh. it's anyone's game. <laughs> Score for Big Bo! Let's do it! Me first! Okay, fine. Then me second! Ah. Yeah. Come on! Take a mask! That's it! Look at me! Huh? I'm the guy who almost ruined Grim! Free? I wouldn't wear one if you paid me! Dawson is the worst! Arr, I need to get in there! Finally, it's my turn. Oh, and it's Grim on the counter. With Super Strikers bull fitting that attack, they've left gaps in the midfield. Grim closes in on Big Bo. Oh, Grim! What's the last lesson, Spike? Identify my rightful place in Grimm, and you'll get to cancel the post yourself. Hmm, Spike's rightful place. My last challenge is at the castle. But we got you covered, brother. Spike has left me no choice. You won't make it back in time. I know a shortcut. Hey, yo, what do you know? My Ruby is the best, and his name is Big. Huh? 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 Hey, you can't go in there. I said you can't! Where did they go? That's freaky. <laughs> you hear that? Maybe the cauldron is haunted. <laughs> Oh, Spike, your rightful place, huh? Don't do it, huh. Big Bo! Shakes? I know it's gonna give Grimm an advantage, but it's not worth letting Spike control you like this. You can cancel this post, but how will you stop the next one? Or the next? It's another post from Spike Dawson. And if he's right, Big Bo has a weakness to his bottom left. <gasps> <gasps> Where are they? I 
can't do this without them. Ah! How do you keep doing that? Blow to his lab. Spike was right. One and three goes in. Four Spike, four Spike. And the fans show their appreciation. There he is. Four Spike. Four Spike. Cool, man. All right. Give me yeah. one. <laughs> Looks pretty good. Look at this. <laughs> Finally, I'm getting the recognition I deserve. Hey, I'm real happy for you, buddy. But you're standing on my foot! <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. Grim is really hammering Big Bo's weak spot. And it's another save! That's two! Will the next one be a goal? <laughs> but Super Spike has defended his concede a corner. Belmont is waving his whole team forward. He really wants to reverse the historic scoreline and win 2-0. <laughs> My room is kind of gloomy and sort of acting like a ghost, but I know he'll always be there when his team needs him the most. Don't bother, Klaus. All I've done is let a goal in. I'm not cheering because you never let a goal in. I cheer because to do our best, we need to focus on our strengths, not what holds us back. Besides, your roomies. Release your seat. I hesitate. Your weakness. One in three shots focus goes on our strengths. <laughs> One big ball. Epic save, dude! Me. Oh, one. Big bow defies the odds! And it's a massive goal kick! Can his teammates deliver on the opposite end? Ah! Yes, they can! <laughs> Give me a B! B. Find him. It's like trying to find a needle in a stack of needles. This sucks. A draw? Spike Dawson's theory's done nothing for Grim. For Grim. Oh, sorry. No, 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 please. You can kick me out, but I'll be back. You will see. Oh. <laughs> Finally, the Skull Stone is where it belongs. That's not the only thing that's where it belongs. I guess we pulled it off, Big Bo. I gotta admit, Klaus, you're a pretty awesome roommate. That's very supportive. Could you try it in chant form? I'll help you. It's Klaus, Klaus, MC in the house. Really? You're all ghosts now? I guess this place isn't haunted. Huh? If we can keep up our current form... We'll freewheel to the Super League Final! Yeah. Nothing can stop me! Uh... I mean us? Uh, no. Not looking good, coach. <laughs> um, coach, don't you think you should be at home? Getting some rest. Rest? <laughs> I need to keep you lot on form for the Technicali game. But, coach man, there won't be a game if we catch a cold. Please, it's not that bad. No, no, no. no, no, no. no. <laughs> it's on me. Super! Super! <laughs> <laughs>
All right. I'll go home and rest. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. No problem. Sure I'll never forget you, coach. Dancing Rasta, you're in charge until I fully recover. You got it, coach. All right, guys. First Whoa we... there, Rasta. You're gonna need this. And a whistle. Megaphone. First aid kit. Second aid kit. Flat cones. Training bibs. Tactics board. Yoga mat. And spare balls. Oh, and one more thing. Uh, yes, coach? Good luck. You guys warmed up? It's time for some football. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Let's go! Tiger, switch it! Shakes mark, run into space. Cool Joe, cross. Dancing Rasta. Oh, that's me. El Matador. Not bad. Now, turn, turn, pick it up. Good. Now, jump. Good boy, Rev. Hmm. Can Super Striker's winning streak continue? I need something to get me back on the field with my boys. Oh, uh, I'm sure I could come up with... Ah. Ah! Come at us, Captain Coach, dude. So shocked. It's just a little something Prof hooked up for me. Now I can coach from the comfort of my. <laughs> oh. All right. Now that I uh, have your attention, let's get to work. <laughs> this sure beats coaching from the sidelines. Yes, Block. <laughs> Yeah. Flick your wrists for even more backspin. Shakes, yeah. watch your non-striking oh. foot. Ah. Huh? Eh. El Matador, ah. practice isn't over. Dancing Rasta, send it to Klaus. Klaus huh? to El Matador. Backfield to Shakes. Yep, got this one, coach. Nice boys. Keep this up, and beating Technicali will be business as usual. Yeah. No problem, coach drone dude. We're here at Strikerland for a special press conference ahead of tomorrow's fixture against Technicali. <gasps> and it seems the rumors were no exaggeration. The new Technicali tour bus is. Magnificent! Look at the size of that thing! Whoa! Tony, you're a genius. You've done it again. Your luxury bus gets a 10 out of 10. Never that is one huge bus. What do we call it, Tony? Oh, you could just call it genius. But why would you need something so big? It's a home away from home. It has everything my boys need on tour. Oh, uh, ah. Well, I'm sure one thing your boys would really like is to beat Super Strikers. What's the strategy, Tony? Uh, oh, I I've run a few new drills. You know, calibrated some uh, tactical... Uh, uh, listen, at least I bothered to show up for this pesky press conference. 
Huh? Sorry I'm late. Whoa. Huh? Wow. I'm a little under the weather. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So innovative. Huh? He just stuck a tablet on a drone. It's not rocket science. But it sure saves time in the traffic. Oh. Now, any questions? Yes, 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 yes. Coach, over here. Dancing Rasta, you are on fire today. Oh, Coach and Rasta. Yeah, you were all like, do this, do that. Blammo, go! Would have been pretty interesting if Coach hadn't come back. Yeah, somebody doesn't know when to take a break. Guys, it's been fun, but Coach deserves our respect and cooperation. Trust me, he knows what he's doing. It took a while. But I think I've got the hang of it. Hey, surely this contraption isn't Super League approved. Oh, I called Super League headquarters. It's all perfectly legal. Anyone can do it. You look nice. 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 Tony, you're a genius. A fact is a fact. Just wish you built this carpet with an auto retract. Do 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 ba do ba do do ba do 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 ba do do ba do do Tony! It's so cramped! Oh, my arms! My elbows! My whole body! Why can't we have real beds? Yeah, Tony! Why can't we just stay in a hotel? Because if you lot weren't all sleeping in here, this gigantic bus would look suspicious! And if I gave you all real beds, I wouldn't have room for all the suspicious stuff! <laughs> Tony! But I hurts. can't feel my legs! If we sleep like this, Tony, what chance do we have of beating Super Strikers? Oh, please. Like winning has anything to do with you lot. <sighs> when, of course, it has everything to do with who's in charge. Begin facial mapping. Now, initiate voice match. One, two, three! <laughs> Match day at Strikerland. Hmm, after a night in their luxury bus, I expected Technicali to be in better shape today. Well, at least they showed up in person. Super Strikers coach is a flying robot doing his job for them. Come on, Mac. What if drone coaching is the future? It'll soon be a thing of the past, Brenda. Um, Mac? Listen up, boys. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Surprise! Oh, oh, oh. Two can play this game, coach. <laughs> Listen up, boys. I know this isn't ideal. This drone might even be annoying some of you. Oh, oh, maybe a little. But we have a game to win. So how about you put my cold and these ridiculous drones aside and focus on playing some world-class football? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dangerous cross into the box. Super Striker Spawn continues to impress. Yes! Now that's world-class football! We can do this! Huh? Eight crazy ways this coach ruined his Super League career? Number seven will make you cry? Hmm. 24 puppies that'll make you want to be a better coach? Win a private island, a billion dollars, and a solid gold El Matador action figure? Come on, who falls for this stuff? Ah, how to get rid of pop-up ads? Yes, please. No! What? Nah, uh, uh, coach. You should know better than to click on suspicious ads. Right. Assume control of coach drone. Uh, uh, uh. Now, let's have some fun. Woo! Ooh. Dancing Rasta! Huh? Uh. I want the guys to slow the game down. Way down. It's okay, coach. We're ah, slower. Run slower. Play slower. Understand? Um, you got it, coach.
isn't working, Captain. Look, guys, we got to trust Coach. <laughs> Even if his methods are stranger than usual. Yes! Oh, come on, computer! I've got a game to coach! Northshaw and the big one. Uh -huh. You're going too soft on their striker. Uh -huh. Yeah, these dudes are kind of lightweights. Don't call the Technicali guys lightweights. But you always call them lightweights. Oh, I do? Do I? Just get out there and show me why I keep you guys on the team. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's another great chance to go one up on Super Strikers. Ooh, a punching tackle by the Super Strikers defenders. What? Ruffians! How dare you, coach? Ruffians? Your players are lightweights. Lightweights? Your players are Neanderthals. Neander. Please don't use big words I don't understand. Of course, the ref has awarded the penalty. It's the chip of the chip! Uh, come on, computer! Now, why is Coach celebrating? That's it! You can do it, computer! Good computer! Tony, you're a genius. Let's keep this one short. No one is more qualified for IT support. This is IT support. Hello, I'd like to report a problem Your with Your call my... is important to us. Huh? Please hold. <laughs> well, that sucks. What even happened out totally there? Totally lame. Don't worry, guys. I'm sure Coach has an explanation. Explanation? Our best strategy is squandered. Do you have anything to say for yourselves? Coach, your new strategies... They suck! There, I said it! They suck! Have to agree. Right on, brother. Sorry, Coach. Uh-huh. Yeah! yeah! That was <laughs> I can't believe it! We're winning, Tony! You're right. It's not over yet. But you're not mad at us, are you? So you're saying you're... Proud of us? <laughs> Tony loves us! Best halftime speech ever! And that's why this really isn't my fault! It's time you boys learned to take some responsibility! You're right, Coachman. Really? Winning is up to us, and the team divided cannot stand. So what do you say, boys? Let's get behind Coach and fall in line with his plans for the second half. Um, yeah. whatever you sure, say. Yeah. Then is the king of the drones. While Coach lies at home and waits on the phone. <laughs> Dancing Rasta! What is going on? Yeah, you're acting as crazy as Coach. His illness is clearly worse than we thought. So, what do we do? It hurts me to disobey Coach, but there is no other way. Can Technicali extend their lead? Ooh! Not if Shakes has anything to do with it. This is more like it from the home team. That's the way, guys. Huh? <laughs> A cracking shot from our Matador. Nice try, Dancing Rasta. But remember who calls the shots around here? What's this, then? The Super Striker's captain is being subbed. <laughs> Coach's strategies have been absolutely bizarre. But benching dancing Rasta? Now that takes the cake. Wait, what? Poach says whatever you think you should do, do the opposite. That way, Technicali won't know what to expect. You want to go left? 
Go right. You want to go high? Go low. You want to get this over with? You bet. Oh, man. Now, twisting tigers on the left wing? Shakes looks pretty confused. Lock is way up in a striking position. And um, Brenda? I see it, Mac. El Matador's back in defense. What is going on? Chuck uh. T. Chipperson looks dangerous. And North Shaw's nowhere near the action. Circle round. <laughs> Hold. Hold. Now pray. <laughs> 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 oh. I can't do this anymore. Come coach. on, guys. Don't quit on me now. Uh, 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 that's me. And... <laughs> uh, uh, now, now, coach. I mean, me. No need for violence against yourself. <laughs> Oh, oh, sorry about the interruption. You've got one minute. Call it injury time. Hey, coach, nice work destroying your own drone. <laughs> what a blunder. My only blunder was trying so hard not to let you guys down that I forgot you have one of football's greatest leaders among you. Looks like it's up to you, Captain Coach. Dude. We're in the final 15 minutes. Can Super Strikers pull it back without a coach, Mac? Not even a drone coach, Brenda. Shakes, El Matador, push up! Tiger, switch! Kujo, again! Nutmeg. El Matador, draw out the keeper. And Klaus, you know what to do. This is the end of drone coaching, Brenda. But why, Mac? Because the only time a coach should be six feet off the ground is when he's earned it. <laughs> you were right, boys. Seems all I needed was a little rest. <laughs> <laughs> You're all sick? Not all of us, coach. In my custom-designed hazmat suit, I'm immune to all this filthy, disgusting jer- <gasps> My beautiful- Mr. Bird, we are from the Super League Disciplinary Board. Mr. Bird, we know you're in here. If we catch you, you may never coach again. <laughs> Can't believe Tony fell for that. Party time! I totally love this bus, bro. Music! Pizza! Soda! <laughs> so, uh, who is Kevin Brinkley? And why is he making a musical about us? Yeah. Football and music don't go together. Huh. All depends how you play, brother. <laughs> hmm. Sir Gavin Brinkley can turn anything into a musical. Haven't you seen Fizzle Boom, the musical? Sir Gavin insists on extensively researching his subject. Faster! Faster! <laughs> uh, can we get on with this? Well, excuse us. Ah, Super Strikers. 
so glad you could join us for our final dress rehearsal. Sure, no problem. Looking forward to the show. Hope it isn't boring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we had the press here last night. And they loved it. Another Brinkley hit. Come one, come all, to Super Strikers Musical World of Football. Uh, what? <laughs> Super Strikers! I run fast and then I kick it. Pack fast? That isn't cricket. Swim dunk! We gotta get a hold in one. <laughs> that shakes, and he's important. High stakes. No reinforcement. Who's oh, that? He's the reason that we won. He's the reason that we won. Whew. At least it's over. Uh-oh. But to understand the winning, we must start from the you ready, son? Yep. Huh? How about you? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing dropped that you couldn't catch. You never stopped, never missed a match. You're the kind of guy who always sees things through. And I'll always be right here for you. Now see here, fellows. I'm glad we won, but let's not rest on our laurels. Yay! I'm still in the show! And I'm gone again. They all want a piece of me. They won't quit. And this guy smells like cheese. Trophies, fame, and scoring goals. I'll admit, I want all of these. But the truth is, the most fun I've ever had was barefoot in the backyard. Playing soccer with my dad. You ready? Yep. How about you? Ha! You got me, Dad. And I've got you, Shakes. So beautiful. I feel joy rising up inside me. I feel something rising up inside me, too. My lunch. That Wah. was the worst. Even I was bad. How dare you? I'm sorry, sir, Brinkley. It's just not us. And it's definitely not me. You got some pretty basic stuff wrong. No slam dunks in football, dude. <laughs> yeah, you need to do your research. <laughs> Who cares what you think? Uh, sir Gavin, you care what they think. Without their consent, you're legally barred from using their lives in a theatrical production. I need their approval? Listen up, boys. Let Sir Gavin do his thing. We have an Invincible United match to prepare for. I agree with the man in last year's suit. You should do what he says. No way. <laughs> Never gonna happen. <laughs> We're shutting it down. This show's just wrong. It's not like you could do any better. <gasps> yes. That's genius. Huh? Super Strikers should tell their own story. They're the ones who've been on the field, scoring runs, slamming dunks, and whatnot. I'll write the music, of course, but the lyrics must be theirs. Interesting. Would be good to get the story straight. Oh, and make the songs a little more mega out of the question. Come on, coach. Do you really want to be portrayed by that guy? Listen up, boys. Hmm, could be better. Ah, lend me your ears, fellows. OK, but you must get someone else to play me. Cedric, you're fine. No, Gavin, this was meant to be my breakout role. That's showbiz. Vince, <laughs> check it out. Super Strikers are gonna be so busy whistling show tunes and signing autographs for old ladies, we'll destroy them. Perhaps, but the extra attention could boost their confidence. Well, the Brinkley Company has sent us tickets to opening night. <laughs> Maybe we can find a way to ruin it for them. I don't mind getting our story straight with Brinkley, but let's make sure we're also match ready for Invincible United. Absolutely. You got it, Coach. Music to my ears. Don't worry, Nanny Garcia will get it. Sir Gavin Brinkley. Good heavens, a gold piano? Oh, it's like the books. Display purposes only. Until now. Shakes, why don't you start? Where did I go wrong with your story? Well, firstly, how could my dad be at all my games? 
He went missing on Mount Kilimanjaro when I was a little kid. Oh, I see. Jomo, Vince, and I all played footy together back then. Jomo was by far the most talented, but he disappeared before he could reach his full potential. He spent a lot of time playing soccer with shakes, though. Didn't he teach you the bicycle kick? Yep, taught me everything I knew. At least, till I was six. Ah, yes, that's good. He taught me everything I knew. Till I was six years old. Yes. Like how to run and tie my shoe. <laughs> Not just that. I got the bicycle down cold. Jump off your kicking foot. Just one chance to make it good. But I've had lots of things to do Since I was six years old I moved on and Dad did too Some things you can't control Way to go, Shakes! Yeah. Maybe we can actually do this! We can totally do All this! All right, guys! You see? That's how it works! We make it up as we go! We improvise! All right, dude! Let's do it! Fantastic! Who's next? I, uh, I once fought a giant octopus! See, now you're catching on to this! When Tiger spins, the fans rejoice! And Cool Joe's got a golden voice! Bravo! Our captain served a submarine! But battled his twin machine! I'm that guy who loves a strudel! And Inyo tried to fry my noodle! Spike and Big Boo <laughs> have an ancient feud! Shakes is young, but a legend, dude! You guys push hard, but you pull together! One, two, three! I push hard! But we pull together. I push hard, but we pull together. Hmm. <sighs> Nicely done. Just a couple more songs to go. I must say, I can never get my actors to work this hard. Oh, we're used to it. Listen up, boys. Get up for practice. We leave for Striker Land in ten. I see what you mean. Uh, Shakes? All right, all right, I'm on my way. There's someone here to see you. It's been a long time, Shakes. Oh, hi. And, uh, you are? I'm Shakes' father. So, uh, Jomo, how'd you find us? Yesterday, I was reading the paper when I came across a review of your musical. Three stars from the Arty Farty? <laughs> They'll give us five when they hear the new songs. It mentions Shake's childhood. Sure, a lot of it's wrong, but as I read it, it started flooding back. You see, I had an accident that affected my memory. Mount Kilimanjaro! Shake said that's where you disappeared. The last thing I remember is a loud crack and a rock fall. By the time I woke up, I was buried in snow and hypothermia had set in. You <sighs> survived that? Legendary! I must have clawed my way up to reach the surface. At least, that's what I was told by the guy who found me. Shake's... I'm sorry. I couldn't remember anything. But I remember now. So, you uh, call this strategy the funnel? Yep. And? We build slowly by controlling the midfield, using the entire width of the pitch. Accurate passing is key. The wings hang wide, then sprint in field. Finally, one of them chips it over to Shakes. It all funnels to him. <laughs> <laughs> the bicycle! You know who taught him that, right? Gnarly air, dude. And a smooth finish. It is a lot of pressure, though, Shakes. Think you can handle that in a match? Sure, no problem. Ha! That's my boy. <laughs> Classic! A through the legs! <laughs> you mean nutmeg? Hmm. Perhaps some of the game's terminology has slipped your mind, Jomo. But one thing no footballer ever forgets is how to handle a ball. Come on, show us what you can do, Jomo. Hey, what is this? You want me to perform like I'm some circus sideshow? You don't have to do anything. You've been through enough. Truth is, I haven't been able to play quite the same since a lion attack when I was a game ranger. Whoa, 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 wait. Oh my yeah, god, was that? You fought off a ravenous lion? <laughs> nah, she was protecting her cubs. All I did was get the tourists back in the jeep, and fractured my ankle in the process. You saved those people! That's pretty cool! Got any other stories? That's enough! Back to practice!
And the power grows! A circle! You never fend alone! A circle! Cause we're the Fender Bros! <laughs> that might not be quite right, but let's keep improvising. Dinner is ready! <coughs> what? I like the little squares, okay? It's weird, dude. Mm. Yeah. Even I think that's weird. And what's with the sippy cup? And that old blanket. My blanket is for sleepy time, and if I don't have my sippy cup, I might spill the apple juice. Hey, Jomo, how about another one of your adventure stories? Yeah, yeah. cool. Sure, but this is more of a funny dentist story than an adventure. It all started when Shakes ran out to me one day shouting, Dad, Dad, my tooth and loose. <laughs> oh, you should have seen that smile. He was- Stop! Please, just stop! What? I don't know who you are, but I think you should leave. Hey, I, I know I'm probably getting in your way, so I'm happy to go if Shakes is cool with that. I, uh... Please excuse me. I'll see if he's all right. Ten? Oh, Mr. Matador doesn't do endorsements for less than twenty. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Don't give me that garbage, Neil! Run the numbers again! But I want to speak to all of them! I've never played a soccer game That you were there to see I'm not saying you're to blame But you weren't there for me Son, I know that things have changed I've been away so long Let's just face it This is strange Can't fix it with a song I've missed a lot of birthday cakes I waited for you every year This is how a promise breaks I've had enough I'm out of here I'll do whatever it takes Come on, don't leave me hanging shakes. Can't we pick it up from here? Remember how I let you steer. Got my license just last year. I taught you how to ride a bike. <laughs> There's another bicycle I like. Ah, jump off your kicking foot. Just one chance to make it good. So. Your memory's kicking up a gear So we're picking it up from here We're picking it up from here We're picking it up We're picking it up from here You've got some mad guitar skills. And you're not bad on piano. Maybe it runs in the family. I'm gonna head out. But I'll see you at opening night, right? Wouldn't miss it for the world. <laughs> Shakes looks like he's about to cry. Sounds like you really made an impact. Well, the background info you gave me was spot on. You and Shake's dad must have been good mates, eh? You know what they say. Keep your friends close and your rivals closer. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I gotta get down there. Don't want to miss the start of the show. You're not watching the show. You're taking the money and leaving town. But I told Shakes I'd be there. Promises, promises. Wait. Okay. Now, listen up, boys. We're picking it up from here. <laughs> I push hard, but we pull together. You push hard, but we pull together. Amazing! We actually pulled this off. All thanks to Gavin Brinkley. Sir Gavin Brinkley. I feel inspired. Yeah, makes me want to play football. Can't wait to crush Invincible United tomorrow. Right, Shakes? Oh. Oh, poor Shakes. Did Daddy let you down? 
<laughs> Just wait till he sees the score in the match tomorrow. Now that'll be a real disappointment. All according to script. And the stage is set for an epic showdown. They may be the subject of a new musical, but can Super Strikers play in harmony today? Oh, and the wings find the perfect rhythm up the middle. The move crescendos with Cool Joe. What can Shakes take it home? Come on, get up there, Shakes. Whoa. But he doesn't have the elevation for his signature move. <laughs> Anything we can do for you, sir? A taxi to the airport, thanks. Of course, I can charge... <gasps> Room 514? This arrived for you earlier. It's a ticket for today's game. Shake sent it himself. We can still pick it up from here. Uh... This isn't for me. Your name isn't Jomo? Just the taxi. Thanks. Coach! Please, you gotta sub me! I'm blowing this! I'm sorry. You have to keep trying, Shakes. Shakes, Mom! Huh? Uh -huh. Can't hit the high notes, eh, Shakes? Duma! To me! Are you sure about this, Coach? He's really struggling out there. Shake's struggle is with confidence. Taking him off will only make it more. Oh! Dude, if you're not feeling up to it, you're never gonna get up to it. But it's okay, Shakes. We understand. Yeah, we're sorry your dad didn't show up. He's not my dad. My dad would have been there, right? I even sent him a ticket to the game. So stupid. Shakes, you have a visitor. You... you got my message. Wait. I'm sorry, Shakes. I'm not your dad. What? What? Dude, you better start talking fast. Or I'm gonna... I'm just an actor. Someone hired me to play the role. Who hired you? The... the Invincible United guys. They told me everything about Jomo. I should have guessed. The only person who knew Jomo better than me was Vince. Whoa! Jomo and Vince? Friends? Shakes? I pushed hard! Oh, hi. And, uh, you are? He's no one, Klaus. And he's leaving. Look, I know I'm just some random actor guy, but if I was your dad, I'd be really proud. It's too bad. Was kind of hoping I'd inherited your guitar skills. <laughs> ah, I know a couple chords. Just improvised, you know? Sir Gavin would approve. You know, we can improvise too. Right, guys? Um... Block, rock a beat. There you go. Oh, I see where you're going with this. <laughs> I push hard, but we pull together. I push hard, but we pull together. Chance to make it good. Goal! Mark Shakes, all three of you. Not much time before the final curtain, and the scores are tied. Does either team have anything left but a big finish? So predictable. He's got the ad, but he's also got company. Huh? Leaving El Matador completely unmarked. Bicycle is that? <laughs> Sometimes you gotta improvise, bro. Yeah! Look who is back in the show! I can see it now. El Matador the musical! Pfft. How about Nanny Garcia the musical? Has a nice ring to it. I'm already tearing up. Hmm, interesting. Make it 60 and we talk! <clears throat> what? Oh. We had a deal! Promises, promises, right? Hey, thanks for what you said about my dad. If only he could see you now. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's time I let go. He's not coming back. Ha! Poor chump. 
He'll never see his dad again. Well, sometimes you want your rivals close, and other times, very, very far away. Huh? <laughs> you know where Shake's dad is? Guys, that thing's about to blow a hole right through our planet. What do we do, guys? Aim for the mothership. Shaft. You are Earth's last hope, Joe. I believe in you! You got this! Hey, aliens, you want some fun? Have a ball! Cut! That line is the worst! The climax needs more oomph, more boom, more kablam! Uh, a little help, please, Mr. Director. This veggie just meant, um, uh, intergalactic! I am tired. I am hungry. I need the bathroom. Out of the way! Great work, guys! That was amazing, fantastic, bada boom! But it also, you know, it sucked. Huh? Shakes, your line is the climax, the blammo of the whole shebang! The line has to wham! So tonight, I'll be perfecting that line. Because tomorrow, we make magic. Kaboom! <clears throat> Mr. Plosion? Tomorrow, we play Invincible United. We agreed you would wrap your shoot today. Ouch. Don't worry. Nothing could prepare your guys better. Have you seen their moves? They're like boom, bam, pow! Hmm. It's true they are working on accuracy, and the suspension scenes could improve their aerial game. Exactly. Now, have you tried the chocolate croissants? They are... <laughs> All gone. After thorough analysis of Super Striker's on-form player, I've identified what is setting Shakes apart. You mean besides being a total dork? Sonya, please. Rather than taking on the defense, there's a 47% probability Shakes will attempt a long-range shot. It's simple. Shakes scores more goals because he takes more shots. Hmm. Yes! <laughs> Ding gone! From the people who brought you Strike Team. Give me that comes a motion picture about family. Mommy, mommy, what is that? Fear. Uh, our planet is simply in their way. Fate. We're out of options, people. We need them again. And football. From Maverick director, Al Explosion, and starring Super Strikers, Strike Team 2, a soccer lips now. Ha! Those losers made another stupid movie? They're almost done filming. Imagine being football stars and movie stars. Sonia? In conclusion, Shakes is the danger man. You have to neutralize him before he shoots. Thank you. Man, this acting gig is actually kind of boring. It's too easy. Just pretending you're someone you're not. Oh, blargo. But life on set has its perks. <laughs> Only some perks are better than others. Right, El Matador? <laughs> All right. Which one of you has been using my private luxury toilet? Not me. I used a portal. I used the one on set. I used the one built into my suit. You have a toilet in your spacesuit. Yeah, of course. Uh, your guys' acting skills are pretty good. But I will find the culprit. <laughs> Let's get the ball rolling. Nah, time to kick up a storm. Lame. Think, Alex, think.
Open your eyes and shut your trap. It's time to put on your thinking cap. I'll give it a shot. Yes, that's it. <laughs> huh? Hello, uh, we're done for the day. Get out of here. Picture this, a young, overrated Super League striker. Stars in a big movie, but one day on set, a harness snaps. Tragic. Or maybe he gets locked in a dressing room. Help, help, I'm a big baby, boo-hoo. No one heard his cries, but the director received a load of cash for his next big movie. Hey, I built my career on two things. Kablam! Macho explosions, and boom, honesty. Can you even spell honesty? H-O-N-E-S-T-Y? Huh? And do you have any idea how hard I've worked? How many Shablamo movies I've made? How many people I've had Look out! off my sets? Mr. Plosion, everything okay? Yeah, Jerry, everything's fine. Thought I heard something. Must have been a little kitty cat. Mew, 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 mew. <laughs> I love that song. What song, doofus? H-O-N-E-S-T-Y? Because we do the right thing! H-O-N-E-S-T-Y? Because we love to sing! H-O-N-E-S-T-Y! Mr. Plosion was singing a song from Crocky the Smilo Dial. You mean that stupid show from when we were kids? Yeah. And he sounded just like Crocky. Okay, let's do this! Bar, bar, bar. All right! Go strike team! Guess what? I had security cameras installed on my trailer. Again with the mystery toilet user? I'll give it up, El Matador. Let's see. Fast forward, blah, blah, blah. Ah, prime time after our morning coffee break. Oh! Big Bo! How could you? <laughs> what can I say? That is one great place to practice my lines. Okay, line. What is your line, Big Bo? It's a... Oh, man. Line bombs, bombs away. away. Right, yeah. Bombs away. Hmm. Updated script from Alex. Got it. Show off. Bada boom. Final scene. Take two. And action. The only way in is that ventilation shaft. Think you can save the world, Joel? I believe in you. You got this. Urgent package for you, Alex. Not now, Evan. <laughs> Who's Ashley Nutterbutt? Huh? Huh? I'll give it a yeah! shot. Cut. cut. That's it. You can't cut now. Clear the set. The match is tonight. Coach, the uh, the line still needs work. You know how it is. Perfection takes time. <sighs> Well, as long as they finish in time for the game. Okay, back in ten, everybody. <laughs> Mom, are you videoing this? Hey, friendly friends. No. Today, someone asked me to tell a lie. But I said no. Do you know why? Not Crocky. H-O-N-E-S-T-Y. Because we do the right thing. H-O-N-E-S-T-Y. Because we love to sing. H-O-N-E-S-T-Y! He's Crocky the Smile of Dial! I was young and stupid! Golly wow, friendly friend. I wonder if this video could ruin your macho reputation. <laughs> Don't bother, Nutter Butt. We made copies. Yeah, and now you have to sign my thinking cap. <laughs> I'll never take it off. All right. What do you want me to do? <laughs> and action! The only way in is that ventilation shaft! Think you can save the world, George? I believe in you! Got this! I'll give it a shot! Uh, Come on, brother! Um, I've read that you scored the most goals this season, Shags! All we need here is one. Take four. And action! <laughs> and... Nothing fancy, Shakes. Just get it in the hole. Take five. Focus on the ball, Shakes. But also focus on the target. Take six. Keep your head down, brother. Yeah, but keep your eyes up. Don't overthink it. Just relax. I mean, don't underthink it either, right? <laughs> Take seven. 
Take eight. Take 32. Take 56. Take a break? Can we take a break, Alex? No! Okay, okay. I'll do it. Ah, forget it! The only reason you lot are here is your soccer skill. It's not like you can oh. act or anything. We'll finish the scene in post. That's a wrap, everyone. Wait, we're done? That's what wrap means. Woo! Yes! No it's more wedgies! Hey, you think there'll be food at this party? Food at this party? Food at this party? Food at this party? <laughs> 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 Jake. Jakes. Shakes. <laughs> You're still off saving the world, Jones. I guess I am pretty spaced out, Captain. Our fans aren't here to watch us fly around with pretend jetpacks. They're here to watch us do what we do best. So let's trade these tuxedos for something more our style. Time for some real action. Uh, El Matadude, locker room is that way. Uh -huh. Why would I use our stinky old locker room when luxury awaits? Bomb uh, away! Uh, <laughs> it's all yours, El Matador. <laughs> <laughs> this summer, one group of footballers must face another group of footballers in an epic battle for possession! Mac, this isn't a movie trailer. It's Invincible United versus Super Strikers. Hey there, friendly friend. Ah! He's fucking Smilo <laughs> So? At the start of a game, it's always 50-50. Unless you can neutralize the danger map. Hmm. We'll see. Invincible United have their box on lockdown. They're like an army. But an army is no match for one man on the edge of the box. They do call him the Long Ranger. Focus on the ball. Focus on the target. Keep your head down, brother. But keep your eyes up. All we need here is one. one, one. Yeah. Take eight. Take nine. Take 32. Take 56. Anytime you're ready, Shake. Yes! Take the shot! What? No! Shake's passes back instead of shooting! Ah! <laughs> He walks off defeated, but Shakes will return in the sequel. You mean the second half, Mac? That's what I said, Brenda. Huh? He's cocky the smile of dial. Then you're looking for a friend. And you've been searching a while. It's, it's time, time to, to play, play with cocky the, the smile of dial. I love it! That show! I mean, loved! <laughs> of course! In the, uh, past. That's what I meant, too! <laughs> <laughs> Today, I met the real Crocky. What? He signed my thinking cap and everything! You met Ashley Nutterbutt! This is Alex Plosion's signature. Yeah, Alex and Ashley are the same person. What? <laughs> That's another thing I learned today. <sighs> I hope none of those strategies include me, coach. Think I've forgotten how to score goals. Yeah, I never thought I'd say this, but can you please stop passing to me? Uh, missing all those shots on set today really messed with my head. 
Then you've tried your best, but you look like a jerk. Lift your head, puff your chest, and just get back to work. What is that, dude? It's a cheer up song from Crocky's A Smile No Dial. <laughs> from when we were little kids. <laughs> that show was lame. I stopped watching it before I learned to walk. Please, it's a classic. And did you know Alexplosion was Crocky? <laughs> no guy. way. The lame dial Hey, people still love Crocky, all right? I mean, Dingan got his thinking cap signed by Alex just today. That can't be. We were shooting all day. Yeah, doing that scene over and over. Crazy. Nice try, Big Bo. But I got you on poop cam. Give it a rest, El Matador. Yeah, now's not the time, okay? Guys, wait. Let me see that footage. Dingan was on set, and not without his babysitters. Huh, what were those dudes doing on our movie set? Coach? Oh, no, 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 no. There's no way you'll make it to the set and back before the second half. <laughs> I beg to differ. <clears throat> okay, okay. Whoa, it's Bruno! Okay, that is really sweet. I have a theory. I just need to... That stung a little. Almost! Hmm? Almost! Hello? Oh, sure, I can take a survey. Okay, higher, no, lower, higher, higher, yep. One man, no, two men in red missing. Huh, sabotage. There's a plastic cover. The shot was impossible. Hey, it wasn't your fault, Chase. Invincible United must have put Alex up to this. <laughs> ah! Alex, you're kind of blocking our awesome getaway. I can't just let you vroom off into the night. Scar and Vince wouldn't like that. They might tell the world my little secret. What? That you were Crocky the Smilodile? What? How did you? But Crocky was awesome. He. He was? Sure. Uh, yeah. Everyone knows you were the most popular TV amphibian ever. Reptile. Still, my reputation as a kapow director could be ruined. No. Crocky's legendary, man. Yeah, everyone's favorite TV show. When they were babies. And all this time I've been embarrassed. So, are we cool? Friendly friend? Abandoned by the ones they trusted most. I'm sure Shakes and El Matador will be back any minute, Mac. Crocky <laughs> <Goal>! <laughs> <Crocky> dance! <laughs> <laughs> El Matador, you're acting. Was awesome back there. No, your performance was amazing. No, you were amazing. No, okay, I was amazing. So, you up for one last amazing performance? They're back, and this time they're playing football like last time. So, where you been, Shakes? Uh, after that first half, I wasn't sure I could carry on. Oh, I needed an extra long halftime break. Leave him alone, Skyra. Hasn't he been through enough? <laughs> Time is ticking for Super Strikers. And there's only one unmarked man in red. Not surprisingly, it's Shakes. You ready to save the world, Jones? Huh? I'll give it... No! A shot!
Matador? Incredible response from the audience. You must be so proud. Thanks, Lena. Now, tell me, is it true you were Crocky the smile Isle? As a matter of fact, I was. <laughs> that show was so bad. Hey, Alex. Hey, Joanny, SD, why did you even make that stupid show? But you guys said it was awesome. <laughs> it's a little thing called acting. It's not our fault we're so good at it. Boom! Hey, I'm the one who talks in explosion noises. <laughs> Ooh, a movie premiere! 80% chance of fun! And there's a 90% chance the Soccer Lips Now will be a box office hit. And there's a 100% chance that I'm... You're fired! I've already called a cab. Four games into your Super League career, and you've won Man of the Match every time. How does it feel to be in the spotlight, Max Power? Well, Rob, pretty rotten, actually. And why's that, Max? Feel a bit bad taking Skara's spot, yeah? It's not his fault he's injured. Feel a bit bad, yeah? Ha! Whatever, schmuck. My injury has helped me relate to people in need. Mega stars with minor injuries? Vince took a risk giving me this chance with Invincible United. I just don't want to let him down. Oh, I'm sure you won't, Max. Although you do have some competition. You having a laugh? Well, with five awards, the only player to win Man of the Match more times than you this season is Shakes from Super Strikers. Woo! Shakes is the best! Well, then it's about time he got to run for his money, innit? Oh, it's time. You gotta level with us, Max. How do you run so hard for the full 90? Ooh, now that would be telling, Robbo. <laughs> Shakes. Home time? Yeah, um, sure. All right, we get it, Shakes. He's your rival for Man of the Match. But, dude, you're obsessed. What? How am I supposed to figure out how he does it without a little research? A little research? Yeah, Shakes. You're taking this rivalry thing to a whole new level. <laughs> Shakespeare, you've been here all night? Uh, looks like you've been... busy. I think you've got a problem, Shakes. I know, I know. It probably seems kind of stalkerish. You think? Where'd you even find this stuff? Did you go through his garbage? You can tell a lot about a guy by studying his trash, okay? Berserker! Block's right. Why is this rivalry so important to you, Shakes? Meh, I'm just collecting some info on him before the game. If you have to collect something, why not collect Super League temporary tattoos? They're free in this new Berserker gum. Block's grandma sent a whole bunch from Brislovia. Uh, yeah, it's like chewing an old band-aid. And those tats are lame. Cheap knockoffs. They don't even look like us. Shakes! <laughs> At least your hairdo is improved. <gasps> Bill Mattishaw? That's not funny. Le Squido. <laughs> that's better. Uh, hey, Klaus, this one's blank. Oh, that's Invisible United. Very rare. But they use some kind of crazy industrial glue that doesn't come off. I had to scrub my arm for like 20 minutes. That's nothing. Check out my leg. My back. My back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If we want any chance of beating Invincible United, we need to do our research as a team. We're in the dying minutes of this match. Huh? Paul Mentieri's Samba style is taking strain. United's new striker is living up to his name. Max Power! Huh. Invitations, 23. Attending zero. Uh the defenders just can't keep pace with him. Neither can his own forwards. Oh, oh my! And he still has enough juice left for a gymnastic celebration. And the man of the match is Max Power. That's five wins in five matches for the new United Striker. The kid's a natural, Mac. Ha! <laughs> Anyone can win man of the match if they hog the ball all the time. Back off, Skara. What? You gonna side with happy face new kid over here? Hey, bruv. I've been injured before. It's so frustrating. You got some kind of charity going, yeah? It's an awareness campaign to create 
awareness for people suffering like me. That sounds great. I'll be there. Cool. Whatever. Nice move calming him down. Just be careful. No one must know. Not even Scar. No worries, Geezer. Mm. I've got this, Governor. Thanks to Max Power's stamina, United keep winning matches in the last 10 minutes. We need to identify who's most likely to keep up with him till the end. But Coach, where is Dancing Rasta? <laughs> Prof calls it the Match Activity Emulation Device, but I prefer the Staminator. This is great, Coach Mod. Almost like playing for real. But what about... Ah! Opposition players? Ah, yeah, that! Avoid them or lose points. And when you've reached your limit, hit the stop button. Six minutes at peak speed, but you dip steadily till the 90. Hmm, that's when Max really has the edge. Don't worry, guys. I'm on the case. Guys, help me and Theodore! Dude, you sound like Scar's pathetic awareness campaign. 24 5 side matches in 24 hours. All to raise awareness for megastars with minor injuries. Sounds like a worthy cause. <gasps> we should go! Negatory, Elmada, dude. Max Power and some other Super Leaguers will be there. Well, good luck to those guys. Oh, come on. Don't make me and Theodore go alone. <laughs> guys? Jakes? Mega egos of minor importance? No, thanks. Ah, so this is why you're so intent on winning Man of the Match. He's always with me. Your dad used to say, keep your friends close and your rivals closer. Maybe El Matador is right. Get close to the man behind the pizza boxes and you could beat him at his own game. one of these before. Everybody's got to do their part, Dingon. Remember, it's for a good cause. <laughs> nice one, Bonesy. It certainly is for a good cause. Chase, huh? you made it. And now you're right next to the guy you've been stalking for the last three weeks. <laughs> hey, it don't hurt to do your homework on the opposition, yeah? <laughs> it hasn't hurt yet. Supporters, one game down, 23 to go. Grab a snack while the fresh legs come on for round two. So, Shakes, do you want the cheese or the pineapple burger? Huh? Dig in, bruv. Hey, thanks. Hmm, never mind. But don't you usually eat two? Yeah, I always take a double, but today, hey, how'd you know? Uh, read it in a magazine? Huh. Yeah, I eat a lot because I burn through tons of calories running around and things, but today I'm taking it chill, yeah? Conserving your energy? Is that one of your tricks for developing stamina? Oh, wouldn't you like to know? How about a trade? I'll show you my famous bicycle kick. For real, mate? Striker's honor. 
All right then. Stamina is simple. Just focus on three things. Posture, breathing, and stride. For posture, you have to run tall. Imagine a string holding you up straight. Next is breathing. Keep it steady and deep, right into your stomach. Finally, stride. Make sure your foot lands under your center of gravity. And that's it. Ha! Huh, these chumps. Trying to be best pals? Yeah. Shakes, you can't be buddies with your opponent. Yeah, Max. Where's your loyalty? Come on. Nah, no, bruv, just the one match for me. What? No point tiring myself out before our big game next week. You can't leave. Sorry, mate. I've got... Whoa! Dingo! Huh? Oh, no. <laughs> Guys, please help me up. Every man for himself. Shakes, help me, bruv. Gotcha, bro. <sighs> huh? Come on! <sighs> Jump, <You're> crazy, bro! <sighs> you totally saved my life. You saved mine too. Kind of annoyed, actually. We're starting to enjoy the view up there. <laughs> Oi! Be careful, you bozos. It's minor injuries, okay? <laughs> so, you're gonna keep up your end of the deal? Oh, yeah, the bicycle. It's easier than it looks. Jump off your kicking foot, lean back till you're parallel to the ground, and snap! You've got just one chance to make it good. My dad taught me. And your family? They play footy? <laughs> Even me grandmom, if you count SL4000X, she's wicked good. <laughs> Finally given up, hey shakes. <laughs> Remember your theory about altitude training in the Himalayas? <laughs> Guess that one was wrong. He was created by mad scientists! <laughs> Bogus! <laughs> My favorite was, he just drinks a lot of coffee. <laughs> Actually, it's none of those things. I got Max to open up to me. It's all about posture, breathing, and strive. You guys like best buds now? Yeah, I saw them sharing secrets and watching sunrises and stuff. <laughs> hey, Shakes, who's that? <laughs> My dad had a mean bicycle kick. Anyway, it's time for a max power failure. Yeah! Right. Pull the plug on power. As a sign of unity, we should all wear tattoos of each other. Uh, uh, no, no yeah, tanks, I man. think I'll pass. Uh, how come Max gets to ride in the limo? I'm the one with the injury. I'm the one who deserves special treatment. Remember. After that stunt at the sky pitch, Shakes thinks you're best pals. Just keep it friendly, and he won't suspect a thing. Since their dramatic rescue at Mega Stars with minor injuries, Shakes and Max Power have become known for their friendly rivalry. Ugh, that's not how you do rivalry. Where's the anger, the venom? The sneaky elbow in the ribs. Yeah, no jokes about his hair, no mockery of his pathetic sports car collection. What gives? Dad? Oh, uh, because he also played footy. Yeah, I told you, the other night. Oh, right, my family plays football too. Yeah, you mentioned that.
Klaus, you got some of those tattoos left? Yeah, sure. How many do you want? Hey, whoa, just one. Oh. Huh? <laughs> hey, Max. Nice work out there. Sorry you didn't score. We might be mates off the pitch, Shakes, but not here at... Huh? Oi! <laughs> what's with the cheesy kids tattoo? Klaus is trying to get us all to wear these. They're so lame, and that one's the worst. <laughs> Shakes, we thought you were done with the stalker wall. Yeah, what about the running and the breathing and stuff? At least that made some sense. He was just throwing me off the trail. Well, you can't just go around hugging people, dude. I stuck a tattoo on it. Great. That explains everything. Okay, okay. Check it out. Notice anything? In this one, he's striking with his right foot. In this one, his left. A and look at this. He always eats two of every kind of takeout meal. And he had no memory of what I told him about my dad. You see? He's two different people. <laughs> <laughs> two of everything. Shakes, I eat enough for three people. Honestly, I've forgotten almost all the emotional stuff you ever told me. And Shakes, man, you strike both left and right. Forget Max, brother. Yeah, and the man of the match trophy. And let's focus on winning the game. But if Max doesn't have the tattoo in the second half, Fine. Let's see how your hunch plays out. Let's do it, mate. You see? He's covering his arm because he's second half, Max. That is pretty strange. I'm gonna get close and lift that sleeve. Leave him to the defense! Shakes has been all over Max in this half. The friendly rivalry has taken a turn for the worse. There's that sneaky elbow. Oh, now we're entering the power zone! Where Max's stamina really shows. Oh! Max's incredible stamina is finally rewarded. Maybe we can be strike buddies after all. Max, you're a legend! No, Scar, you're the legend. Oh! Again? My strike buddy better not get all the goals. But Shakes is still not giving up. He really wants that Man of the Match trophy. What are you doing, Shakes? Huh? What? Had to scrub super hard, but it came right off. You think your dad would be proud of you today? Some crazy industrial glue that doesn't come off. my arm for like 20 Check out my leg. My back. My butt. Shakes! Forget Max! Let him have the award, Shakes. It's all good. Cool Joe! Yes! Shake still has some gas in the tank, Matt. Huh. Maybe he was saving it for the final seconds. But can he outrun Max Power? Come on, Shakes! Shakes ends Max Power's winning streak! But only just, Matt. I guess all that investigation stuff paid off. Nailed it! It's not over yet. We can still win this game. Uh, what? Hey, sorry, Max. I know you really wanted that win, but a draw is a pretty good start to a legendary rivalry, right? Yeah, whatever. Huh? Oh, I've been meaning to show you something. Fine. What on earth? Shakes? This is creepy! Ah, uh, you should be flattered. Hey! Oi! Not funny, mate! And the Man of the Match Award goes to... to... Shakes! Thank you. It's such an honor. But I couldn't have done this without my... friend and rival who pushes me beyond my limits. He's twice the man I am. Max Power! Come on up, buddy. This prize is yours. What a loser. Even when he wins. <laughs> uh, let's help him, guys. He's shy. Max Power! Max Power! Come on! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Help! I'm in here! Max Power! Max Power! Got it, buddy.
Shakes! Showtime's over, dude! Don't believe it! Huh? No way! There's two of them? Shakes was right! Thanks, bruv. Thanks, Gov. Back off, sir. You gonna side with happy face new kid over here? No one must know. No worries, Geezer. I've got this, Governor. Twins? Nice one, Geezer. Serves you right for not telling me! Two for the prize of one. Give it here, bruv. It's mine! Uh, Shakes, looks like you won the prize and the match. <laughs> Can't believe that punk almost elbowed me out of my team. Ah, those crazy kids. We tried to warn them. Uh, hope I didn't give you the wrong impression, Slick. But we are not friends. I know, but uh, I brought you a gift. Ah! They won't come off! <laughs> nice one, Klaus. Man, that rival thing really worked. Don't think I've ever pushed myself so hard. Sure, but there's a bunch of guys here who can push you even further. Friends close! Rivals closer! Teammates closest of all! Oh, oh, oh. Still close after 90 minutes of football? Matador, hit my face! Hit your own...